Hi everyone, it's Sammy Caps. We have a patch in season four and it's a doozer. Let's check it out. Okay, so Pez Radar, this happened tonight. And as you can see here, Pez Razor, we have a small Diablo 4 patch going out here momentarily across all platforms. We have some underlying performance and stability improvements and here and some gold cost adjustments with master working material caches this will require a download and if you go on to the blizzard website you can see right here 1.40 on all platforms and it does require a small update guys the amount of gold it costs to transmute master working material caches has been significantly reduced now they don't mention how much the cost has been reduced but i'm going to show you exactly how much it's going to be reduced okay so if you head over to the alchemist do you guys remember you would be able to get and purchase crafting materials now if you don't remember this cash itself was six million gold it is now only sixty thousand gold and if we go down the list here if you guys remember two million used to be the cost of this cash it's now twenty thousand this used to be so etc 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 the cost of crafting materials for master working has gone down one hundred percent hallelujah now if you've been living under a rock <laughs> i don't know how you could have not known this but everybody everybody was complaining about the cost of master working and the the trillions of gold that you needed in order to master work all your gear let alone the additional cost of failing and bricking uh, an item through master working it just became a huge issue. This is the reason why I did not masterwork my gear yet. I was silently hoping that they would do what they just did. So another big W for Diablo 4 and Season 4. And I have to say, guys, I have a couple of comments in reference to this. And that is, are you guys paying attention to what's happening lately with the Diablo 4 dev team? This is like not how they normally act. And I have to highlight it. If I'm going to highlight the bad, I need to highlight the good. And I'm highlighting the good in reference to them really changing their mindset when it comes to reacting to what they're hearing in the player community. This is another demonstration of how they're not only listening, but they're actually responding quickly. This is very quick of them to respond, at least against to what they've done in the past where it takes years and months. I'm exaggerating here, but you get the point. It takes a long time for them to implement stuff. And I'm starting to see a trend here where they're listening and they're actually implementing it as quickly as they can, which is a nice thing to see. So I want to highlight that and applaud them for doing it. Uh, this is a good thing. Look, if you're going to add itemization to a game, you cannot, you cannot roadblock that path with these just stop gaps that prevent players from really min maxing their characters vis-a-vis -vis through master working and obviously the cost of gold was preventing players from getting min maxing their characters and their gear so applause to the dev team for doing this this is really good reducing the cost by 100 percent awesome 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 great job not only on the fix, but on how quickly they jumped on it. So this is a double win. Uh, I'm super happy about this. This is, look, 
people want to min max their their characters their gear so by removing and eliminating this roadblock it's it's just a, a good thing now if they could just one little thing blizzard and that is the tempering i'm getting a like i have personally experienced it and other players have come into my stream and complained about it when you're tempering an item and you're re-rolling the affects and when you're re-rolling it gives you the same the rng for example out of five tempers you'll get the same affects four times three times Come on, Blizzard, do better than that. I know it's RNG related, and I kind of kept this personal complaint of mine. I kept it to myself, even though on stream I've complained about it, but I didn't do a video on it. But I have more and more people coming into my live stream complaining about the fact that when they're tempering, they get the same affects over and over and over, and it bricks their item. Now, it's happened to me several times. Um, so if you could work on that, Blizzard, that would be awesome. Look, I'm not asking for guarantees. Bricking an item is should be part of the game. I understand that. It's RNG related. But come on, when you're when you're tempering and you and you have six rolls, because one is free, and four of them are the same affects. That's a little I don't know. I don't know about that. I don't know. Let me know what you guys think. Anyway, huge W, guys. Uh, you don't have to sell your house, mortgage your kids, and sell the wife. Uh, you now can afford to masterwork your gear. Halla friggin' Luya. Anyway, let me know what you guys think. Um, this patch happened. It's on all platforms. It does require a small download, guys. So if you've been away for a day uh, or two, Make sure you update your game. Get this in the get this in so it's not costing you a ton of gold uh, to masterwork your gear. Anyway, let me know what you think. How are you enjoying season four? What do you think of this change to the gold? I can't see anyone complaining about it. And I want to remind everybody: come watch me live on Twitch, Sammy Caps. I stream every evening. Love to have you over. Talk about Diablo Four or whatever you want to talk about. We'd love to have you. we got a great community. Anyway, thanks for watching, everybody. And as always, we'll hope to see you next time. Take care. The opinions expressed in this video are mine and solely mine. Healthy debate is always encouraged. Hate is never welcomed. So get over it.